there's fear. There's fe uh, uh, a lot of respect for the government here. A lot of respect. I just uh, believe that eventually I will probably lose the land. Not that I'll quit fighting, but uh, obviously to fight the government, you need revenue. And where is that going to come from for most of us? You can see. Yeah, I mean, we, we're not wealthy. Uh, all we have is the land. It's val that's what's valuable for us. You can fight all you want to in court. Uh, you can continue to fight them, but they'll, cons they'll do the construction. So, how does that make me feel? Well, we're hoping to do a variety of things, and of course it's dictated by whatever any client that calls us wants to do, but mostly to help people defend any claims that might be filed against them for access or condemnation, make sure that people are aware of the steps that they need to take to fully exercise their rights in this process. Um, and something that's really important, I think, is just to alleviate people's fears, that the fact that you get served with a lawsuit by the U.S. government doesn't mean you've done anything wrong. You're not obligated to sign a waiver to avoid that process. In fact, it's your constitutional right to go through that process, and you shouldn't be afraid of that. And so. We really want and people to know around, that you know, and, and to and have the assistance the that they need to feel comfortable with that process and not be intimidated by it in any way. And I'm going to continue to, to um, learn more about what my rights are, um, uh, prepare myself uh, to be able to defend those rights, um, and, uh, and um, hopefully with, with the help of, um, of uh, some rep you know legal uh, representatives I can I can get the right terminology to use in the event and I know that we're going to court but I want to be able to to justify in a significant way why it is that I must hang on to this property our, our descendants are going to be as attached to it and so it'll be lost you know it's stress that probably is going to be uh, taken to the deathbed.